Hey guys, pleasing others is something that we all do. As much as we feel that it is unnecessary, I mean, who doesn't like to be liked by others, right? But there is something that we need to take into consideration. We can't please everybody. There'll be people who will love us, there'll be people who do not, and there'll even be unnecessary people who will hate on us. But we should not let this fact and these people who dislike us affect us. If you're struggling to accept this like how I used to, here are three pieces of information which will allow you to be immune to these haters around you. Number one, know for a fact that you are unable to please everybody. Why? Look at these. These are my eyes. They are small Asian Chinese eyes. These are my set of eyes and your set of eyes might be different. Your eyes might be big, blue, bubbly, I know. But what I'm trying to say is that we all have different eyes, which means that we are bound to view things and people differently. We are bound to perceive things and people differently. And we are bound to interpret things and people differently. And if we are all different, how is it possible that we are able to please everyone? Person A might think that your antiques are entertaining and interesting. Person B might think not really. And sometimes it might even be a person C who thinks, oh, what the hell is this guy trying to say and do here? So yeah, different eyes, which is why we view, perceive, and interpret things and people differently. So, don't bother trying to please everybody, and don't be bothered by the fact that you are unable to please everybody. Number two, know for a fact that this life that you're living here is yours. Many a time, we forget about our own ownership over our own life. Like seriously, we are the owners, we are the proprietors, we are the bosses of our own lives. We are living it, not other people, not the people who hate you, and not even the people who love you, because they have the lives of their own, and this is yours. You are living it. It is just you. Learn to use this life ownership sensibly. By that, I mean that you can allow the people whom you love to boost your emotions, to motivate you, to inspire you, and you can disallow the haters to affect you emotionally. Number three, know that life is short. An idiom that I always like to use is in the blink of an eye. For example, in the blink of an eye, I am done with my A-levels. In the blink of an eye, I have been a YouTuber for three months now. And in the blink of an eye, I've been a YouTuber for three months now, but still with very few subscribers. Okay, life is short. It is described as in the blink of an eye, not even two eyes because it is short. Life is short and it will be over in the blink of an eye. Okay, I did not do that intentionally, but yes, life will be over in the blink of an eye, and in the blink of an eye, you'll be at another stage of your life. You'll be doing new things, meeting new people, achieving new goals and aims in your life. And by that time, I don't think that you'd even remember and recall any of those current haters. If I were you, I would focus on the people whom I love and care for, focus on the people who love and care for me, and not on the people who dislike or hate on me. There you go, three pieces of information that will allow you to be immune to the haters and people that dislike you in your life. You cannot please everybody, you gotta learn to live your own life, and life is short. P.L.S. Please, please know that you cannot please everybody, and please learn to live a happy life. Thank you very much.